Well, New Year, new laws. Before the clock strikes midnight on New Year's Eve, you might want to brush up on some of the state's new rules. KCAL 9's Lori Pettis joins us from Studio City with a look at some of the new laws that take effect January 1st. Lori. Elsa, every new year brings hundreds of new laws here in California, laws that affect the way we work, live, and play. Transgender people are celebrating what some call a practical and principled victory. Under Senate Bill 179, transgender people don't need to prove they've had clinical treatment before applying with the state to change their gender on their birth certificates. It also adds a non binary option, so starting in 2019, people who don't identify as either male or female don't have to choose on their driver's license. It's the right thing to do. It, why force people to live uh, and have government documents? Uh, um, represent them in an inauthentic way and in a way that they're not living their lives. At Burbank Ammo and Guns, owner David Schwartz says they're being flooded with questions about yeah, new restrictions yeah. on buying ammunition. You can still go to any of your local pre existing gun shops and buy your ammunition. But if you're like many who shop online, Schwartz says new regulations will change the way you buy ammo in two key ways. The main part of the ammunition law that starts on January 1st, 2018. Requires that all ammo transactions take place within a licensed California dealer. However, the background part of the California new ammunition laws don't come into effect until July 1st, 2019. Lawmakers are giving graduating high school students some relief in the new year. They will no longer have to take an exit exam, testing their math and English skills in order to get a diploma. As you can imagine, it's one law teens are happy to hear about. It's just one less thing to worry about, honestly. So, I mean, I can fo focus on college apps now instead of all the other tests that I have to take. And from the file of new laws that change old laws you might not have known existed, with Assembly Bill 390, you will no longer be penalized for starting to cross the street when the red hand signal is flashing, as long as it's still showing time to cross. I didn't know why they needed to change it, so uh, it's been pretty clear. It seemed to be working before. You can find full information about all of California's new laws on the California State Legislature website. Back to you.